Hello and welcome to my Ultima 4 Quest of the Avatar walkthrough series. We are down here at level 8 of Dungeons of Seat and we are here in this hallway that has got a ladder at one end and a ladder at the other one. Just where we left off and we're going to go up this ladder to the north here but I just kind of want to take a peek and just make sure there isn't anything in the hallway. Nope. Okay. It's just a hallway. So let's climb. Alrighty then. And let's peer at a gem. Okay, so here we are. We are, this looks to be quite an intricate level. So we're the red dot. I think the other stairway down, ladder down, is the other end of that Trixie hallway that we saw in level eight. So, I don't know if we need to go into the, so these 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 dark rooms here. These are combat rooms, and there's one there. So I don't know if we need to go through that or not. Um, I suppose we could go into it and then just come right back out the same direction. We don't need to pass through, but maybe we should go just in case. I don't know if the stone is going to be in a room like this. So maybe in the interest of leaving no stone unturned, we should go in there. So I guess maybe that will be our first step. But first we do have... I uh, can't do it. All right, so we've got gremlins someplace. They were there, and now they're gone. Oh, they're in here. I thought this was supposed to be a combat room. Maybe those squares just mean doors, because that just looks like the ladder down. Okay, so now we got to fight these guys. I'm not going to worry about doing a tremor on this, whoops, on this few of them. Because I think we will kill them long before they get close enough to steal any of our food. These little gremlin guys. Yeah, we're already down, down one here. And now we're down two. So there's just one left. Well, let's see. I, I don't think you're going to help much. I need to move her out of the way so I stop trying to have her attack. Yeah, very good. All right, dude. You just, you do you. Okay, so we've got a door there and a door there. Um, and, and this is going to kind of go around in a loop. So I, it, it probably doesn't matter which door we go through first. I think we'll go through this one. We'll go south. Okay, and so we've got this area with two Balrons. Nice, so I'm gonna cast Negate. Unless there's a, there are a couple sleeping, are they sleeping or are they sick? I guess we'll have to try to talk to them later. Um, all right, so I'm gonna, we're gonna have to, you're gonna have to wait your turn. Jana, I might leave up here. I mean, it shouldn't take us too much to take out two of these guys, I wouldn't think. You can come down, you're stuck. You can come down. How dare you? All right, I'm coming over. Because you can come over. You can come down. I'm just going to leave you be. Tiana, you're going to stay there because I'm going to, well, I don't know if I have to, I don't know if we can talk to those people uh, is what I'm wondering. Let's see. So that's, uh, that's Dupree with a magic bow. Iolo, Julia, Shamino. All right. Lightly wounded. Joffrey's able to use a sword. And I was like, Dupree can't fight, but he doesn't need to be there to fight because he's got a bow. Amazing how that works. All right, come on, Joffrey. There you go, good job. All right. Uh, 
I'm just gonna have you wait. Oh, it came out over the water. I, I, I guess that makes sense. It's got wings. Julia can get him. Heavily wounded. Critical now. Well, I don't think you're going to be able to do anything there. Now he's fleeing. Good luck with that. I don't expect that to work very well for you. Gone. Beautiful. Okay, so you can come down. You can come over. You can come over. You can come over. You can come over. You can go up. Down. Over. Down. Over. Down. Down. Over. Can I talk? So we can't talk to these people because technically we're in combat. All right. So we got to make our way out of here. I'm going to make my way over toward the gold. I don't know if that's supposed to be a dead body or if that's supposed to be a, a sick person. I mean, usually when we're seeing those in towns, it's somebody who is ill. But I don't know about here what that's going to be. Oh, actually, crap. No, this was... Oh, no, we want to we wanna walk through here. I was thinking it was the one where we just wanted to turn around, but that was when we fought the gremlins, so we don't have to... We don't have to worry about that. Okay, we do want to walk through here. Okay. Making good progress, I guess. Okay, I can't walk through that guy. I guess I'm going to take a hit to get out of here. Forty-six gold. So I got gold. I guess we'll see how badly I get hurt. I'm not really super duper worried. We've walked through lava before. <clears throat> That took a fair amount, though. I was at 800, now I'm at 766. So that's, what, uh, um, 34 hit points? That's, that's pretty solid. That's a solid hit. I will say. Maybe I will rethink that next time. Certainly if we end up having to come back through this room for some reason. I won't bother with the gold. Okay. So we went south. Right, 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 right. So if I look up this way, there's another door. Okay, we're going to do what, because I don't, I mean, this goes in a loop here. I don't need to go, if this opens to another room, I don't need to go all the way through it. We'll have to we'll have to fight whatever's in there. But I'm going to do the thing where I go in and then we'll come back out the same way if it turns out to be... I just don't want to skip the room because I don't know if stones are going to be in the 
in these combat rooms. So let's see. Holy moly. That's a whole lot of skellies. And, I, you know, I don't at the current time see... All right, get you guys, I guess, I don't know. Oh, those are force fields. I thought that was water. All right, so save your, save your shots. For now. All right, so. You aren't going to do anything. You aren't going to do anything. Dupree can come up. Iolo, you're going to stay there. Okay, I'm going to be a bit of a tank here. I'm just going to cast Dispel to the west. All right, so now we're going to have this one portal of death that we'll probably have to do another portal of death up at the top as well. Um, because I don't think, y yeah, our, our um, weapons are not penetrating this shield. I mean, we could probably walk through it. I'm not totally certain on that. But why take, why take damage we don't have to? All right. Fortunately, like usual for skellies, they're pretty much one hit when we hit them. Oh, they can walk over the they can walk over the uh, the gold to get to us. Well, that's good. That means I don't have to do another dispel spell. I actually wasn't going to do that anyway. Um, more I thought about it, more I thought, well, let's just kind of husband those a little bit, but that was a mistake. And actually, these people that aren't doing anything, yeah, I might as well have them get out. Ugh. These two are just going to be stuck here because I don't feel like moving everybody around enough to... to give them a hole to get out of. But that'll at least cut down on the turns a little bit here. All right, very good. All right, good. I'm gonna move in, start moving in here. I'll let these two just stay hang hang tight for a minute. Let's let's go ahead and get our melee peeps working their way toward the exit. And I'm gonna work my way up toward the gold. I'll take these two with me. And then if any of these skellies want to come over and get frisky, then that's perfectly fine. Good. All right. Let's move on up. These two probably don't need to move. They can attack from where they're at. I will move up because I need to get the gold. So I'll just leave them there and they can uh, assist. With my pillaging good good so I should have a couple of chests there forty six gold good and there goes the last skelly all right so I guess I will get rid of these two guys and have them get out 
34 gold, beautiful. Seventy three gold. All right. Oh, that was Dupree's turn. Not my turn. Sixty five gold. Wow, we're up to a grand already. I remember that the last time I was in here that they were really. Really, I would have thought there would have been more multiples there, but there's not. Okay. All right. So now we are facing south. Let's uh, actually pop over to the notes and review the map again. So we've got this door that's right in front of us. That's this one right here. And then we're going to come down and there's another ladder going up. And then we've got four things of traps, and then we've got some sort of, these are en energy fields or, or of some, some form. We'll find out when we get there if they're poison or what they are. I think when we get like down to this ladder, I'm going to appear to gem again because I don't think, I, I don't know that, I think this goes beyond what the screen is showing here. So we're going to do, do that yet again when we get down there, but we will pass through the store and see where it takes us. Hey, for once it's just a door. So we're gonna go down this path, we're gonna turn, and there's the ladder up. So that'll take us up to level six. And then we are going to, so there's the ladder. So there should be traps right in front of me. So let's take a minute before I move further forward again. And let's peer at another gem. Okay, so um, we reveal that we've got uh, now a full circle there. We, this, this ladder that we're standing in front of will be the one that we need to go up. But uh, we have an onk there. I don't know if that means, I don't know what that means. I don't know if that means that's the location of a stone or if that's something else. So we're going to have to go and check that out and find out exactly what is going on here. All right. Wins. Interesting. Oh. All right, so cast Shamino is seven. All right, so we're we're in this we're in the traps now, and these are energy. So I'm gonna see if Shamino can do a dispel. He can. All right, so we've got a little bit. Now we got a poison. I'll see if my uh, uh, magic points have um, rejuvenated here. And we're going to do another dispel. Oh, so we're hitting them all. So. How many of these darn things did I make? Not enough. I might have to make some more. I've got all the reagents. That's why I bought all that crap. It's another altar. Oh. We found the blue stone. <clears throat> okay, so it's like the image of the altar. And now we know it's the blue stone. Hot diggity dog. So let's go over here. So we know it's blue.
and we know it's blue. All right, all right then. So, blue, white, purple, green. So at this point, I'm gonna, you know, like I said, I'm 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 laser focused on the stones. So we are going to <laughs> turn back around, and we are going to get back to the altar room of truth. And then I guess we'll we'll work on getting the other stones we need for that one, which are purple and green. Um, okay, interesting. Okay, so now we know. All right, we go back to the traps. All right. All right, there we go. The winds were putting out my. So, this was just a door. That was a combat room. <clears throat> this was a combat room. I'm trying to remember which one, which one was. This was the one with the skellies and the energy fields, which is going to make me do another dispel. This was the one with the Balrons, which I'd probably have to do at least in the gate spell anyway. How many negate spells do I have? Oh, I made a bunch. So I'm good on that yet. I'm down to four dispels. Um, so I probably need to mix some of those sometime soon. Hmm, 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 hmm. I think I'll choose Skellies over Balrons. Okay, so I'm going to go up. You can come over. You can go up. You can stay put for the moment. You can stay put. Everybody else can stay put. And I'm going to come over here, and I'm just going to work the melee folks through. And I think I'm going to work most everybody through. Maybe what I'll do is I'll have Jana. be the third person in our little party here. Oh, that was Joffrey. All right, I should have had him walk. Because that way she can... <sighs> I need to get Joffrey moving. Quit trying to have him attack. I'm talking to me there. All right, that one's gone. All right. You can stay put. All right, you get out of there. You get over there. You go up. You go up. You go up. You go up. You're going to wait right there. All right, up, over, up, up, over, up. Yeah, I think I can have Jana start to come up now. Oh, what happened? All of the all of the stuff went away. Interesting. That didn't happen last time. Huh. That is an interesting development. All right. Well, then let's uh, get some killing done. I mean, it's not really that big of a surprise or, or danger because it's skellies. I'm just, I'm just surprised because the room is acting differently this time than it did last time, which is odd. All right. We got some stragglers. We're probably going to have to clean up here. So, oh, I could have, I could have fought that guy. I might send Joffrey up to take out those two. Okay. And I think I'm going to get everybody else making their way out. 
Yeah. That'll be good. Okay, that should work. Joffrey can get a little bit of XP. I'll head on up and get the gold. All right. That is all of the skellies. Oh, I forgot to hit get there. All right, that holds 25 gold. 30 gold. Oh, did the wrong guy. Also did the wrong guy. 43 gold. 57 gold. Acid trap. Okay, I'd rather have that. Then the alternatives Gremlins. Okay, so we need to go. We came through there. So, past the Gremlins should be our ladder down. Okay. Uh, Joffrey, I don't think you're going to get much of a chance to do anything. That goes double for you. Good job, people. I'm impressed. It's going to look well on your performance review at the end of the game when we evaluate pro when we evaluate progress and beautiful. 19 gold. We're up to 1490 gold. Beautiful. So we will descend and we are back on level eight. And so we've got a bunch of stuff to go through. <laughs> All right, so we gotta go down here. Uh, let's actually, ooh, my, my hit points are looking scary. Let's hold up and camp. Get some health back for everybody. Nobody's in danger, but you know, we can do it, we might as well. All right, and we are going to go through this door, which I think is into another combat room. Oh, yeah. I do recall this. All right, so our Mystic Sword people need to hang back on this one to start. How dare you? All right, well, you're kind of... In your sword. Okay, good. I'm awake. Yeah, you can you can put Joffrey to sleep. That's perfectly okay. Oh, he's awake again. They, you know, their sleep spells don't seem to be super duper effective. I must say. <sighs> that doesn't mean they're not annoying. Well, Joffrey's not doing anything. I'm wondering if I should have, if I should have, what's her face, uh, do a, or Shamino. That's the word I'm looking for. If I should have Shamino do a negate spell, but. That seems like a bit of a waste for these bozos. You know, all they're doing is... It's just annoying right now because I'm blocking the bridge. And I don't know if if a negate spell would actually stop this kind of spell casting. Well, anytime... Well, let's see. I think what I will do... He's going to cast Awaken on me. Because I realized as I was editing the previous video that that was something I could have done when uh, Jana was sleeping. Is I could have 
And you know what? Uh, you're a sword person. You're a sword person. All right. You're a sword person, so you're worthless to me in this particular context. All right. I'll bring, send you up there. All right. Uh, Joffrey. Lightly wounded. Okay, that's a headless killed. Okay, heavily wounded. It really is a shame that... Heavily wounded. Really is a shame that uh, Joffrey and, and Jana can't use a ranged weapon. There's Shamino again. Uh, now nah, you're just annoying me. All right, one down. Guy's heavily wounded. I guess I'll, I'll work on getting us to the other side because I will probably wake up at some point like I did just then beautiful good shot I Iolo Another good shot. Beautiful. So there's one headless left. And I guess I'll take him out on my way to get the gold. Heavily wounded. That's a good. All right. Get the majority of my people working their way out of here. I believe I know what the tri what the trigger was because you'll notice that the 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 um the secret wall there is not marked at this point. And um I watched very carefully as I was editing the previous video to see at what point did that become marked. And like the bridge just went away. So the bridge goes away when you get on that last span of the bridge. And I'm going to leave her here just in case I need her over there. I'm thinking I don't. But what I saw, yes. When I step on this tile, you will notice that that spot that I got through before is now uh, visible. Whoops, okay. All right.
33 gold. All right. All right. Alrighty then. So we are kind of in this little roundabout section. Um, before we get to the um, hallway of traps, which is right there. But I think what we're going to do is uh, I'm going to let that be that. We will stop here. I will be back with the next episode soon, and we will continue. We will get back to the altar of truth and go into the next dungeon to get the next stone. But I will let that be that. Thank you for watching. Please come back for the next. And until then, be seeing you. Oh,